as to why people don't feel like they can improve reading comp, I think there's a couple of reasons. One, the most common reason is that when people start studying for the LSAT, they do poorly in all three sections, <laughs> but they do the worst in games, right? And so it's the one that garners the most attention. They go after it with intense focus. And when they do that, not surprisingly, they improve, right? And so their score goes up. And so what happens is their game score improve. And then at some point in their prep, they kind of realize that, wow, my game score is actually better than my reading comp score. And what can I do about that? And they, they start doing some things, but they feel like they're not making as much progress. But what they don't realize is that they haven't put nearly as much time or effort into that that they put into games. So that's one thing, right? The other thing is that games is is a section, and same with logic reasoning, it's, it's, it's more concrete in the sense that there are very specific steps you can take, and when you miss those steps, we can say, hey, why didn't you do this? And then it's like, oh, okay, and then you start incorporating that into your process, right? With reading comp, there are steps you can take, but there are not that many. And once you understand them, it's really about getting better and better at those two to three steps than it is about learning more steps, right? Or learning more rules. So with games, it can be like, oh, well, here's a new rule you haven't thought about. Here, draw it like this. And you're like, ah, okay, I got it. Whereas with reading comp, I'm gonna be saying the same thing over and over again. You gotta learn how to read individual sentences. You gotta then learn how to translate those into ideas and then you have to learn how to put them all together, right? There are, are certain skills that you can learn for reading comprehension, and, and there's only two or three of them. And, and so <laughs> to get better, it's not like I can give you more information. Instead, what you just have to do is double down and start doing that. It's like, oh, there's only two or three exercises at the gym, but now you just have to go do them repeatedly until you get stronger. And so it does take time. That said, it definitely is improvable. And if you improve your reading comp skills, it's going to pay off not only for the LSAT, but also for law school and later. Because law school is just a bunch of reading.